My name is Matt Garofalo, and I'm an Associate Solution Architect here at Aqua Security. In this video, I will be showing you a key feature with an Aqua's container security platform called the Risk Explorer. I will be demonstrating how Aqua's Risk Explorer utilizes automated host and workload discovery to assess and monitor all of your current running applications within a single pane of glass. Let's get started. So here we are in Aqua's Risk Explorer. Again, utilizing the automated host and workload discovery, we're able to show you all of your current running workloads within a single pane of glass simply by deploying the Aqua CSP within your Kubernetes cluster. We provide you a thousand of an overview of what sort of images are running in your environment, and I'll also provide you risk-based assessments based off of the scan results of that image. So here, we can take a look at if this image running has any sort of critical vulnerabilities, have we found any high, medium, low, or negligible ones as well? Have we found any malware within this image? As well as giving you information about have we found any sort of sensitive data? And has it failed any of the assurance policies that you use when Aqua scans an image? Not only do we give you all the information about the running images, but also provide you the active hosts or nodes that we deploy the solution on, giving you similar risk-based insights about the vulnerabilities hiding within those uh, hosts based off of our scan results. But let's take this one step further. Using this risk assessment filter in our top right corner, you can go ahead and view which workloads currently dealing with critical vulnerabilities. You can see which workloads have high, medium, low, negligible, and which ones are have no vulnerabilities at all. And from here, this gives you a lot of vital information for you and your teams to go ahead and better understand which workloads are most vulnerable, because that in turn allows you to better focus your remediation efforts more appropriately. But let's dive deeper even, even further. If I scroll down into the, my blog namespace, we can see here that I have two workloads, this WordPress server and this WordPress database. Simply by hovering over this workload, I can take a look at how many images and how many containers are in use, how many hosts it's running off of, and how many network connections it's having as well. If I am to click on this particular workload, we break down the risk associated with this workload in regards to the image in use, providing you again that risk insight based off of the scan results of that image, where we can actually click on show containers and see if this container running has any, had any sort of blocking events. Have we detected anything? And what kind of privileges it may have? And we also provide you actual risk-based insights on the actual infrastructure it's running off of. Not only do we give you all these risk insights, but we also provide you a list and visualization of all of the inbound and outbound traffic coming to and from this workload. So hopefully you can see why the Risk Explorer can give you a lot of vital information about your running applications. Now, it is important to note that all this information in the past has been difficult to collect, correlate, and communicate appropriately to the effective teams. So this is where Aqua and automation come into play, utilizing the automated host and workload discovery. And remember, this could be a great place for you to go ahead and create reports for not only our management, but the respective teams managing these applications to give them better insights about the security risk with their applications. So that's it for this video. Thank you for tuning in, and hopefully you can see why a tool like Aqua can be beneficial to help securing your container and cloud native applications. Again, my name is Matt Garofalo here at Aqua. Everyone, please stay safe and please stay healthy and have a great day. Thank you for joining.